Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Ruth and today we're going to film a what's in my hospital bag. So this is a very highly requested video from you guys and um, I'm a first time mom so I might have overpacked. So just a disclaimer. So I'm gonna show you two bags. Uh, on this bag here I have, uh, this is my mommy bag. <laughs> This is everything for mom <laughs> and uh, everything that I need for myself. It's here. Let's show you guys. Okay, so on this uh, mommy bag right here, uh, I have so many things. When you open it up, uh, dito madali lang makuha yung document stuff ko. So everything that is needed, like admission slip, IDs. Insurance cards, baby book, it's all here. Na kakailanganin namin. I just put it there. And I have divided everything in small bags. So this bag right here is the mommy clothes bag. Everything that I would need um, the mat, everything related to the mat and clothes, it's here. Alright. And uh, I also have here a toiletries bag. So my tolly trees are all in this black thingy here. I'm gonna show them to you isa isa mamaya. I have my makeup kit, small makeup kit just to look presentable also for photos. And I have here, which, which is very weird. Um, this is just a, a bag with um, everything that will help me with my labor. <laughs> so this is my labor kit bag. Everything that I think that will help me um, during the labor process and everything. Kasi I just want this easy access. Ayoko na yung magbubukhang kala ko sa bag. So I put them all in one small bag. So yun. And here sa pocket niya, I have my power bank. Very important. The extra power bank, inimpake na namin. So ayun. And um, also something na hindi ka siya sa ano sa mga kits is this one. This is part of the toiletries. This is the Charmy pants, uh, menstrual pants. So para siyang actually it looks like a di adult diaper, but it's for menstruation and post maternity. So kasali dapat siya sa aking toiletries bag pero hindi na siya. So this bag right here is you can see it's a beautiful um, it's a beautiful brown bag uh, which I bought uh, when I was still working as a flight attendant. This is from Madden Girl. Yeah, if you're just wondering. Ang tatak niya is Madden Girl. I got this from TK Maxx. It's cheaper there. <laughs> so I and this is just a duffel bag. And really nice and cute. So let's go ahead and um, let me show you kung ano yung mga laman ng ano ko, ng labor or labor kit. So here in my labor kit um, mini bag, I have two tennis balls. <laughs> Kasi I have research na yung when you have back labor, masakit sa likod and putting pressure on your back using your hands, your husband's fists or tennis balls will help. So, pwede mo siyang gamitin ng tennis balls lang or you could put it inside the stockings or inside socks. So, yun. I just have it here. Prepare. Okay. And I have this mini bag here na merong maliliit na stuff. Inside, I have uh, headbands, headbands to help me with the labor um, hair, labor hair thing. Uh, I have here this eye shutter, just in case I want to sleep during labor or I don't know if I want to dim the lights and I cannot dim the lights in the hospital, I can use this shutter <laughs> para ano. Kasi I research na when you are in labor, yung natural pain reliever mo is oxytocin. Yung hormone natin, the hormone of love. And oxytocin releases when it's dim, it's warm, and you feel secure. And mga ganon, yung primal way of giving birth. So yon, I have this one. I have very important hair ties. Ko pang ano, pang tali ng hair. And then also, I have here petroleum jelly, just the plain one, walang scent. Kasi alam ko na sa hospital it's air conditioning and magda-dry agad yung lips mo. And when you do the breathing, sabi nila grabe mag-dry ng lips. So it's very important to have a lip, ano, lip balm or any petroleum jelly for that matter. 
And um, I also have some clips for the hair. Pag magulo. And I have my trusty Katinko. Um, this Katinko has been with me all the time. It's very comforting for me. So, sabi nila, when you're on labor, anything na uh, comforting for you when you are stressed or anything like that will also help you. So, yun. I have this here. And I have the extra headset ni husband. Tinago ko siya dito. Kasi, um, baka makalimutan ko magdala. So, at least meron na. Um, meron ng headset. Kasi, I want to listen to hypnobirthing CDs while I'm in labor to coach me through the breathing and how to cope with the pain. So, ayun. So, yun yung laman nitong ating mini, mini bag right here. And more stuff inside my labor kit. Um, so, hinalo-halo ko na yung things na inisip ko na during uh, I was in labor, uh, na kailangan ko talaga. So, I have slippers. I bought one from me. So, I just like these slippers kasi meron siyang ridges dito. Pawisin kasi yung pa ako. So, hindi ako mai-slide. So, pag may ridges siya na ganyan, hindi ako mai-slide sa, sa sarili kong chinelas. Okay. And then... I have right here uh, some snacks for me, prunes, also to help me eliminate kung ano man ang kailangan eliminate para walang kambal si baby, you know na. <laughs> realities of pregnancy <laughs> or realities of giving birth. So, ayun. Uh, I also have here our extra charger. Hindi ko pa siya natatanggal sa box. Extra charger for the iPhones kasi nasa iPhone lahat ng mga music ko and relaxation um, CDs for the birth. So, kailangan naka-charge siya. Kung kailangan siyang i-charge sa outlet, meron. And then, kung kailangan siyang i-charge sa power bank, meron din. Alright. And I just have socks. Kung kailangan ko, pag, pag nilamigan ako. I have here, ito binili ko toto sa Momzilla Fair. This is a herbal pillow na microwavable. So, para siyang hot compress. So, para siyang may, may mga bigas siya or grain sa loob na meron siyang aromatherapy na peppermint. So, you just microwave it. Tapos, mainit siya. Good for 20 minutes. So, pwede mo siyang ilagay sa likod or sa lower back if it helps at all sa labor. Kung gusto mo naman malamig, just put it in a plastic bag. Tapos, ilagay mo siya sa, ano, sa freezer or lagyan mo siya ng ice. Plastic bag, tapos itabi mo siya sa ice para lumamig din yung laman. And then, okay din siya as cold compress. I'm gonna bring that. Okay, uh, I have here also this uh, classic hot and cold compress. So, this one, you could put ice on it or you could put hot water on it. If this is not enough, meron din yung isa. And then, uh, I just have a mini tissue paper. Baka sipunin ako or whatsoever. I wanna have tissues with me. Um... I have here, para siyang, ito, this is ORS New, para siyang Orisol. So, you mix this with water para hindi ka ma-dehydrate. So, I just wanna have this because ayokong ma-dehydrate while well, I'm on labor kasi that's not good. And also, here I have, this is just uh, lalagyan siya, pero inside here is a mist, a facial mist. Uh, I put uh, witch hazel on it just to and water just to refresh me if I think I need to refresh myself but I don't know if I'm gonna use that and here on this tiny box here I have here an essentials essential oil kit okay so it's just this um, gusto kong mag burn ng oil while I'm on labor if we have the chance so hospital if it's okay I have to check with my hospital so what happens here is that you you just put a tea light candle like this inside here. Siyempre, lalagyan, sisindihan mo siya. And then, you could put some essential oils. So, on this kit, I have uh, lavender inside dito. Naka-impake na siya. I have uh, lavender. is supposed to help you uh, with the relaxation. And then, if you need some energy, you can use ano, peppermint. So, this one is my lavender oil. Okay. Bango niya. So, lavender helps you relax. And then, the peppermint naman, it helps with the contraction. Uh, kung hindi ka nagko-contract or whatsoever, if you need a burst of energy, peppermint is the oil for you. So, yan. I've been, ano, using this kasi. Uh, I've been using this ever since I could remember. Ever since I... I 
Ever since, I think, grade school, uh, high school, ever since I discovered aromatherapy, I've been into aromatherapy then. So, ayun, I just have extra candles here and lighter, very important. So, ayun. That's it for my labor kit. And then, let's move on sa mga things na nasa aking makeup kit. It's just a very basic one. Sa aking makeup kit, uh... I don't, I don't want to look, you know, hindi naman ako to, sobrang photo shoot, diba? Just, I want to look presentable para if my guests or ano. So, I just have here my BB cream, um, my concealer for my under eyes. Uh, I have a powder. Uh, this is a Misha face powder. I have here lip balm na tinted from Human Nature. And I also have this Misha lip and cheek tint. Okay na ako dito, natural look. And pang kilay, because kilay is life. Okay, so I have my face shop designing eyebrow pencil with the Gimme Bros. Um, Gimme Bro. Bro Volumizing Fiber Gel. Okay, and uh, I have my mascara. So, ayun, that's all the things that I need for this. Um, to look, you know, natural look lang <laughs> after giving birth. So, that's what's inside my makeup kit. And for my toiletries bag, okay, these are my toiletries. I have the Charmy pants. Let's see. I have this, um, I have more pads. <laughs> I have this Modest Maternity Pads. Okay, you saw this on my haul. Uh, ganito, some of it, I already created some padsicles. Ito yung padsicles. So, lilagyan ko lang siya ng aloe vera and spray ng witch hazel and I put it in a zip lock and then I put it in the freezer. So, this padsicles, um, nakahiwalay siya kasi when we arrive at the hospital, gusto ko ilagay siya sa ref, uh, sa freezer ng ref. So, after ako mga anak, you know, para pang pa, ano, it's a good thing to have. And also, here, meron ako yung tox. Uh, this is, uh, naka ano din siya, naka freezer din siya. It's for hemorrhoids. <laughs> so, ilalagay mo siya on top of your maternity pads. It's supposed to help out with that, according to research. According to my research. <laughs> Anyways, so ayun, um, let's see what else is in my toiletries bag. So, I have here my extra vitamins. Because I'm maybe we will be spending two or three days at the hospital the most. So, I need to have my vitamins with me. And then... I have paracetamol. Maybe I would need a painkiller after giving birth. So I have those. And let me see here. Okay, so nakahalo na rin dito yung mga things for my hair. So this is a dry shampoo in case I don't want to take a shower or I don't want to wash my hair. We'll see. Dry shampoo. And then uh, I also have uh, this mini kit inside the kit. These are my, I know. Um, these are my pang shower stuff. So these are just freebie ng hotel. This is a mini L'Occitane body lotion. Um, this is a conditioner, mga mini sizes. Then we have the L'Occitane soap, malit lang na size. So mga hotel sizes siya. and. Uh, this is from Diamond Hotel Shampoo and Conditioner. Um, this is a dental kit, toothbrush, and toothpaste. And some uh, cotton buds na travel size. And also some floss na travel size. We also have this small um, Listerine travel pack na mouthwash, just in case, in the middle of the night or whatever. Um, meron din tayong hand sanitizer. Okay. And meron akong unscented deodorant. Uh, I have your virgin coconut oil. Um, I'm planning to use this in place of a baby oil for baby massage. I don't know. Maybe I might use it. I don't know. Uh, important thing, I should have my moisturizer. Because <laughs> after I wash my face, kahit moisturizer lang okay na. Kasi very dry yung skin ko. So I have here uh, sachet ng Myra E. <laughs> okay, yun lang yun nakuha ko sa ano. 
and something for the uh, breastfeeding to help me with the breastfeeding I have here the Lansino HPA lanolin um, nipple cream I don't know if I'm gonna use it pero it's going to be my first time to breastfeed baka sumakit so this might help uh, I also have this milk shells from I think this is Madela, Madela milk shells. And dun dito sa aking hall, maternity hall. So what it's, it does is it's a shell, ganyan. So para pag namamaga yung boobs mo or yung nipples mo, meron siyang protection, parang protection siya. So hindi siya maano ng bra, hindi siya masasagi ng bra o masasagi ng yung hospital robe, meron siyang protection. And also inside this Thingy, I have these breast pads, disposable breast pads that I got. Sa ano? I got for free then when I was ordering. May mga pasobra sila. So I have a couple of those. Maybe I will need it if my guest or if pauwi na kami. And also, ang, bin ang dinala ko is pang breastfeeding hack then or pang breastfeeding thing. I bought this uh, manual pump. This is the Haka pump. I bought this online. So just in case I need to pump milk, I have it or to stimulate my milk if hindi siya dumadating. <laughs> so I just I'm just going to bring this one. Uh wala akong ano, wala akong electric pump. Uh, I'm I haven't bought it yet because I don't know yet if I'm going to use it. Kasi yung iba it works naman direct latching. Sayang lang, mahal pa naman ng electric pump. So, yun na yung lahat na nasa toiletries ko. So, this is the mommy pouch and this is where the things that I would use or wear. Dito lahat. Dala ko ng towel. I don't know if may towel sa hospital or just in case meron kaming dalang towel. On our mommy pouch, we have this um, slippers na pang indoors. Galing din to sa hotel. Free lang din to. And then uh, I have my disposable underwears to say I don't want to ruin my underwears after giving birth. And I also have this trio na underwear in black para maha ano after giving birth I'm gonna use those. I also have my Winx binder with me. This is the ultra one in medium, so I could use this after mga nak para kasi sa swelling and everything is supposed to help you. And then I just have here sa mga damit naman I have a robe okay I don't know um baka pag may bisita or if it's too cold I just have a regular robe with me para makatulong sa ano sa lamig lamigan pa naman ako or para maging decent naman ako pag may bisita tapos ano magpapa breastfeed or whatever uh, I also have this um a uh, breastfeeding tank top. Okay, I already showed this to you guys. Uh, I want to bring it with me. Uh, I was thinking I could put it under my um, nursing or uh, under my hospital gown or something like that. Because easy access, sha. Or I could also wear this paowe. So I'm bringing it as an option to wear paowe. I'm just gonna bring wear this with some shorts. Yun yung plan ko. This with some shorts and some kimono cover up. So alam niyo naman, mainit sa Pilipinas, so <laughs> hindi masyadong ano yung suot ko. Mga lightweight materials lang. So this kimono uh, para dun sa nursing tank top ko with shorts. So that's the plan. And in case I want to have uh, leggings, ito rin, I have black leggings. In case na yung gusto kong suotin pa uwi. My plan is just to wear the nursing, ano, I, my plan is just to wear the hospital gowns that is available because I don't want to ruin my clothes. And I don't really mind, hindi naman ako ganun ka-arte <laughs> when it comes to that. And I have my nursing bras, the one that I bought in Mother Care. So, I showed this to you already on my buntis haul. So, Two of them, just in case I would need all of them. <laughs> and then um, another option for going home clothes is this um, dress. I just bought this yesterday. This is a very nice dress, very lightweight. Then, very ano siya, loose lang. 
Tapos, long sleeve. Tapos, easy access siya dito sa harap. This is not a maternity dress. It's a regular dress. So, I could pair this with my slippers. Yun lang din ang susuotin ko pa. Uwe, mag-slippers lang ako. Uh, and then, ano, 30 minutes lang naman yung biyahe pa uwi. And also, inside that bag is this uh, laundry bag. This small laundry bag from, ano, libre lang din to. Para sa mga soiled clothes na I might bring. Might use mga soiled clothes na ni baby or soiled clothes ko. We will put it on this laundry bag right here. Alright! So, ayun. Ayun na siya. Yun yung lahat ng sa mommy. And uh, lastly pala. And lastly, I'm gonna bring this um, nursing pillow. So, this is the breast friend. Nabili ko lang din siya online. Gusto ko tong nursing pillow na to. I don't know yet if it's gonna fit me. Siyempre, bagay-bagay yan. But, ang gusto ko sa kanya, meron siyang support sa likod. Ayan. May support siya sa likod. Makakabit mo siya around you. Dito, meron siyang parang kabitanan. And then, para steady siyang ganun. Tapos, ano siya dito, parang firm. Hindi nahuhulog si baby when you breastfeed. So, firm siyang ganun. Yun kasi yung mga reviews ng iba about the boppy pillow or any other pillow na medyo mahirap. So, eto, I hope that this helps me out with the breastfeeding. So, I'm gonna bring it to the hospital. I might use it for the next two days or so while there. So, me and baby are gonna practice breastfeeding. <laughs> so, ayun. So that's it guys for everything that is na dinala ko for me. I think I've overpacked. Comment down below if you think I have also missed something or may nakalimutan ako very important. So this is just for me. I'm gonna do another video for baby stuff. So kasi masyado nang mahaba. <laughs> so I think I'm just gonna cut this video here. And I will see you guys on the next video which I'm gonna show you the things that I bought. Uh, I'm going to bring for baby in the hospital bag. Thank you guys for watching. Give this video a thumbs up and I will see you guys on the next video. Bye!